I'd like to share the University of Olivet Simulation Lab with you. The importance of the simulation education is that students learn in numerous different ways. Students learn, as all humans do, by hearing things, by seeing things, and by touching things. And using the high fidelity and medium fidelity mannequins that we have helps the students practice through situations before they occur in real life. Just like other situations where you're trying to establish what might be a muscle, muscle memory, and muscle memory being, being something that turns into you doing it automatically. Um, how hard you push on your accelerator or your brakes is a muscle memory example. We're gonna create some muscle memory examples with our students where they run through the scenario. Maybe it's CPR, maybe it is doing a nursing procedure, like catheterizing, starting an IV, uh, giving medications, the basic things that nursing needs to know so they can take safe care of our patients. We can duplicate those situations in the simulation lab. Here we also have all aged patients. So we have a baby, we have a laboring mother, we have an older patient with many disease processes, we have pediatrics, and then we have our regular adult patients. That allows the students to walk through situations that could occur in a high uh, acuity situation. So we're talking in more of your hospitals that are going to do high level trauma care, uh, high complicated deliveries, and also your chronic disease patients. So more of your urban settings, people who are taking care of themselves at home or who have home health care, who have palliative care and hospice. These situations, being able to individualize and make sure that our students get the muscle memory necessary, all of the access points so that they will remember these pieces individually and we're able to deliver socially just and appropriate care depending on if our patients are in an urban setting or in a more rural setting. So the University of Olivet's bachelor's in nursing program, from pre-licensure all the way through, has been strategically developed to serve the needs of Central Michigan. In our Central Michigan area, we have hospitals like the University of Michigan Health and their Sparrow entities that are going to allow us to do our clinicals in their areas. This strategic relationship is going to allow our students to have both urban and rural experiences so that they are prepared to take care of patients when they graduate. So the importance of simulation mannequins in learning, specifically in healthcare learning, is putting the whole picture together. So our students, let's say they're learning about heart disease, maybe congestive heart failure. They can read about it. They can read about the multiple organs that it affects. They can read about what they should be looking for to determine how diseased the patient is. When they come into the simulation lab with their clinical instructor driving this work, they can take a look at these mannequins. They can hear congestive heart sounds. They can hear congested lungs. They can feel pulses that are weaker because of the extra fluid in the patient's body. All of those pieces lets them put the learning objectives together prior to the time that they're in the hospital caring for someone with congestive heart failure. So our high fidelity and medium fidelity mannequins do more than just allow our students to touch and see things that they might not see either in the hospital or before they reach there. We're able to program them for scenarios. We're able to program them for health issues. We're able to change how their heart and their lungs, their respiratory rate, even their temperature is so that they can make these assessments. These scenarios are run through our computers and in addition, they're recorded. So every session the students have, they can watch it and they can learn from what they did, what other students did. And we can watch their progression all the way through the nursing program from being lesser skilled to more skilled. According to Becker's Healthcare, Michigan is slotted to be state 10 out of the 50 states for nursing shortages by 2030. If you're considering a career in nursing and you want to learn compassion and excellent care, consider the University of Olivet.